Yo, this is so broken. There's a new way to skip the crouch animation altogether, so you're legitimately teleporting from standing to crouching in a fraction of a second. It's stupid. This is gonna make you almost impossible to hit. It's gonna make peak shotting, ghost shotting ridiculously powerful. Reddit user Zanubis2442 just discovered it, so credit goes to him, but I'm gonna do a bit more of a breakdown here today. So normally you have crouch as control on PC and R3 on controller, and you have aim down sight as right click or left trigger. You can have it on whatever though. Basically, all you have to do is hit crouch and aim down sight at the exact same time, and you will skip the crouch animation. Or you can also hit crouch first and then aim bound sight a fraction of a second later. This is so stupid and overpowered. I'm gonna show you some different angles of how this looks from your opponent's point of view with peak shotting and box fighting to really demonstrate it. And I'm gonna show you how you can use it to literally dodge shotgun shots. First, if you're on controller and you have crouch slash repair on the same button, instead of just having crouch by itself, then you need to watch this video above, then come back here or you will not be able to do this technique at all. Here's a view on how insane this is with peak shotting. What I'm doing here is I'm aiming down sight first for the shot, then when I'm ready to duck, I let go of aim, crouch, and aim back in again to crouch immediately. Insane ghost shots. Literally as soon as I shoot, I'm already hidden behind my ramp. It's absolutely ridiculous. You can do this to duck sniper shots really quickly or repeatedly ghost shot, so you can shoot your opponent without taking any damage back. The other time this is super effective is with box fighting, and you can do this with or without the ghost shot. Let's say I have this window in front of me. It can be any opening as long as you have some cover to the left. What you want to do is shoot, crouch, turn to the left, and walk forward all in one motion. What this does is it completely changes your hitbox level in a fraction of a second because you're instantly crouching. So this means that they can't really headshot you. Plus, you're turning, so you're also moving away from when they were aiming a second ago. It takes your damage aversion to a whole nother level. You'll feel like Neo with the way you're dodging bullets so easily. If you shoot, then aim in, or shoot and aim in together, your shot is going to look like it's coming from literally above your head. And if you're on controller, you can kind of abuse the L2 spam mechanic with it as well. Last up, I'm showing you how this looks once slowed down. I have left up the replay timing so you can see that I'm not cutting anything out and it's actually just skipping the animation altogether. It's absolutely nutty, it's totally broken, and it's probably gonna be patched pretty soon, so get used to it while you can. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe with notifications on to always see my new content. One other thing worth mentioning is I've just started doing paid coaching lessons. I'm doing live one-on-one -on -one creative sessions as well as gameplay reviews, so make sure to email me at directyt at gmail.com for more details. Anyways, that's all we have today. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.